Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some Jelly Belly syrups. We have the Very Cherry, Pina Colada, Watermelon, and Tangerine. We found these at Ollie's. They were $1.49, I'm thinking. Um, the Very Cherry is, it says two tablespoons is how they measure it. It's 30 calories. Uh, Pina Colada is also 30. They might all be 30. Nope. The Watermelon is 40, which is surprising for the same amount. And the tangerine is 30. So watermelon, for some reason, it's more calories. So you can use this with shaved ice and make... Um, like snow cones. Yeah, like snow cones. We, or you can use it in uh, like popsicle uh, containers. And so that's what we have. We bought this at the Dollar Tree. It was just a dollar. And it makes six, but we're only making uh, four today because we have the four syrups. These do come with a seal on the top, but I just took it off for, for the video to make it quicker. Uh, Kevin has filled up uh, four of these with a fourth cup of water. So what you do is you use half and half. You're going to use fourth cup of water to a fourth cup of the, um, the syrup. So I'm going to take my cherry and I'm going to fill it up basically to the line. And then I'm going to do the same with all the other ones. This is the Pina Colada. They come out really easy. These are uh, really nice bottles. And you just give them a gentle squeeze. And um, it comes out really easy. Uh, you might uh, try to find one. Let me show you this. I'm just now noticing this. For some reason, it was leaking in the bag. And we thought, why is this, uh, which one is leaking? So it's the orange one that's leaking. And I'm just now noticing it's leaking because it cracked. And I didn't even notice that put when I... Put the lid on too hard. When I, um, uh, yeah, they put the lid on too hard. So that's why it was leaking in our bag. So just, I'm going to pour this one out like this because I don't want to... So just, there wasn't anything wrong with it. It just, you need to be careful that uh, you watch for that. So then I can add my little lids here and we're going to put this in the freezer and what we'll probably do is leave it in the freezer overnight and then we'll actually review these for you tomorrow we left the popsicles um, in the freezer overnight it probably doesn't take overnight yeah, just, just whenever they freeze yeah whenever they freeze they're they're ready but we it's easier for us just to put them in there and leave them till the following day uh so, so of course, these these molds are only a dollar so if you had a couple of them, you could always have one rotating in every other All half. All the time, set yes. Overnight. Yes, so. definitely. Uh, we're going to try the very cherry first. They come out of the mold, they're a little uh, syrupy, sticky. Mm. I love the texture. Mm -hmm. And yeah, it's very strong. Almost too I, strong. I lo oh, I love it. I think it's awesome. Love the the strong cherry flavor. You see, notice how the syrup settled. Yes. So and the bottom is just ice. It's just ice. <laughs> um, the texture of this is different than your typical popsicle. Yeah, it's not hard. It, yes, it's not hard at all. It's uh, there's like layers of ice mm -hmm. to it, and I I guess it's because of this syrup. Um, maybe the sugar or something that lets it freeze differently. I don't it's know. wonderful. It's very good. It really is. Now. We've only let these, we've done one previous uh, video, and uh, we only let them stay overnight. So if you leave them in there for a week, they may be hard. They may get hard, yeah. but just if you leave them in there overnight, they're this wonderful texture. Mm -hmm. So now we're going to try the watermelon. Watermelon. And it is a very light green. Whoa. Cold. Mm mm. Strong. Yeah, that, that one might be a little too strong too. That is very strong. It's a nice watermelon though. It tastes it like is the a jelly nice bean. watermelon. I think if you used a little, a little bit less. less yeah. That's the thing about these is you need to know which ones to use like half water, half syrup, and which ones. You know, that's that's the great thing about them is you can scale it. If you want it stronger, you make it stronger. If you don't want it as strong, you just. Yeah. Pull back a little bit. Let's try the tangerine next. The one, the, yeah, the tangerine. Yeah, this one. I love that. 
See, like that. It's a little strong too, though. That, mm -hmm. I was going to say, for me, that's perfect. That one, you know, we used half and half on all of these, and so the watermelon was a little heavy to me. Yeah, the orange that was, was a little strong perfect. Too. And I love the, the cherry. The cherry was mm -hmm. perfect. Okay, so the last one we have is the pina colada. You're like a pineapple coconut. Mm hmm. And wow. I like that one too. It's very strong. Very coconutty. Yes. But if that's mainly coconut. You do get the pineapple, but it's mainly coconut. Mm -hmm. I think that is delicious. It's good. I think cherry was probably my favorite one, but the but the pina colada is probably second. It's one of the cherry and pina colada are really, really close They're, for me. Yeah. Uh, cherry was my favorite as well. Uh, then uh, pina colada and then tangerine. Uh, I like the tangerine quite a bit. And watermelon's last just because it does need uh, a little bit less of the syrup. So, and honestly, for me, uh, we did, like I said, we tried four of these previously, um, and there was only one of those that we would have scaled back yeah. a little bit on, so. Which is pretty good. So would you scale back on any of the other ones, or just the watermelon? Watermelon and, and maybe the orange a little bit. Really, okay. Yeah. So, so that's like I said, that's the good thing about using these is try, uh, try it out and see. And if you're, if you, if you or your child, if you don't like the strong flavor, uh, just don't use as much. Yeah, that's a good thing a about small these. Small splash of it instead of the large splash. Yeah, but they're really, really good. <laughs> they are good. Uh, so if you can find them, I recommend them. And thanks for watching.